Hi, welcome to the Tower of the Mummy, where we're renovating the top 11 floors into luxury apartments of 144,000 square feet. On the north side of the building, we're replacing all the gaskets with wet seal. Right now, we're about 60% uh, done with the side, but eventually we'll have to continue and do the entire building. Last week, the generator rocked and was installed. Um, they're pulling wire right now. We're putting the panels into the side, so we'll finish up getting ready. Um, should be a good month of invoicing. We're about to look up the show. Uh, behind me is an example of one of the 16-foot panes of glass that we have to replace. Father uh, and Duncan, we have five locations that we have to go around the building and replace them. We're in the basement, uh, we're in the utility room. Uh, behind me is the new water pump that we'll be putting in shortly. Uh, to the right is where the new fire pump goes, and Regent's down here now installing all the new switch gear and panels for all the electrical for the building. This is one of the uh, heaters, unit heaters we put in the building to try and get temporary heat through the winter. We're running about 6 million BTU. We have two gas heaters, one in the basement, one in the floor, each one in about 1.5 million. And we have a uh, 250,000 BTU electric heater on each of the 11 floors we're working on. It's been a challenge to get heat in the building, considering like two-thirds of the building we're not doing any work, but we do have water and other items running through there, so it's hard to get all the buildings warm enough to keep them above freezing in the, some of the colder days we've had this winter. We've completed most of the high roof work, uh, about 95% complete. The only area we haven't been able to finish yet is right under the window washing equipment because the owner hasn't figured out how to move his equipment. It's frozen uh, shut to where it's at right now and uh, weighs too much for anybody to move. And the enclosure behind us, um, somewhere this uh, spring, as soon as the weather gets warm, we're looking at doing a helicopter lift. Um, we're going to lift in um, 27 uh, units plus a cooling tower. Um, but that'll happen sometime this December, this March. All right, get in there. Welcome to the elevator penthouse. Um, four of these units of uh, motors will annually be pulled out. We're putting two new motors in now. The owner has a change order for two additional elevators in the future. Uh, we're going to re uh, refurbish all the existing elevators, or all four of these new elevators we put in. We get a chance to a new base contract, and hopefully soon two more change orders. Hi, we're on the 28th floor. We're at the penthouse. Um, up here, they're putting the metal studs up right now, so we can do the uh, future ceiling spray insulation. Uh, the insulation is three inches thick, so we have to get the metal studs up and the um, top of the walls so they can uh, spray to them. Uh, this is the 18th floor. We're the furthest along. Um, all the metal studs are up, the electrical, the plumbing, the HVAC has been, all the roughs been completed on this floor. Um, we're up to floor um, 21 with the plumbing. Uh, we're up to about 23 with the electrical. The uh, um, metal studs are done up to 27 plus almost finishing up with the 28th floor, skip the 27th for now. Um, the only thing holding us up from finishing this floor is some architectural details on the knee wall and that we need to get uh, squared away before we can start boarding and finishing up these floors. This is the chase infills we have to do uh, for an old chase that uh, runs to the top of the building from the basement. It's about 420 foot tall. We started around uh, 300 foot filling them in. The biggest challenge in this area was to get a temporary platform in so we can work off of it to get the first level in and then we can work off of uh, those levels as we install them all the way up. Thank you for taking a tour of the Tower on the Mami with us. Check back in a couple of months and we'll show you how far we've gotten.